Pascal Aka, not AKA Aka. Oh, what's up? Welcome what's up? to the show. How are you doing? No, I'm doing fantastic. Yes, yeah. you look. At, what do you think of the two of us? You know, matching up like this. I together? think he's way taller yeah. than you. You shouldn't be standing <laughs> close to him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fully stop, fully it, stop. It, it's as if we plan to be in wine today. Oh, Christmas time. I oh, know. Yeah, I mean, yeah, wine is a colorful colors, yeah. Christmas. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Pascal, how are you doing? I'm doing fantastic. Man. I think you're one of the happiest people in Ghana right now. The, Ga the Ghana Movie Awards is uh, just about to happen. Uh, Movie Awards is about to happen. And uh, my man Pascal is topping the list with a lot of nominations. 18. We're going to be engaging him. He'll be telling us more about it. How are you doing again? <sighs> It's amazing. It's so, um, before we talk about the movie which was nominated, and which movie was that again? Gold Coast Lounge. Gold Coast Lounge. Let's talk about what you've been up to in the past couple of, uh, let's say, a year. Okay. I mean, obviously, I'm not uh, directing music videos anymore. Yes. You know what I mean? Um, it's around 2018, which I announced that I retired completely from music videos. Talking about music videos, which of the videos have you, did you produce? Just, just so audience and listeners and viewers can, can will know. Okay, if I pick five, I'll get in trouble. But anyways, I mean, uh, of course, as you know, years ago, my career blew up with EL. I yes. directed EL's first five videos. Kalu. Obu Mo Kalu, Turn yeah. the Lights Down. Uh, uh, D Black's Vera, these are the yeah. old ones and stuff. And then, yeah. other than that, the VIP videos like Zogo Yaro, yeah. um, Koliko. The I list is just people. endless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's had his time. I, I like that when they talk about music videos, he's produced a number of classic hits videos that we've seen. One of my favorites was when the uh, Kalu was released. I just love that video, hands down. Yeah, that, that, that was a that was revolution. Crazy. Yeah. So, I mean, so you, you, you quit music videos and that you ushered yourself back into something that you were really passionate about yes, that was yes. uh, film directing. Yes. What did you start off with? In um, Ghana. Well, in Ghana, years ago, um, I did two movies that I was hired to do from other producers. Okay. I did Double Cross and I did Interception. These are other productions that hired me to direct. Mm -hmm. uh, but this one, Gold Coast Lounge, is my actual production. Me okay. as executive producer, writer, director, you name it, all those things. Tell us about Gold Coast Lounge. Now, Gold Coast Have Lounge. Have you seen it yet? Not yet. Not yet. It's not out yet, but uh, right. anyways, now maybe she got a sneak preview. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's the thing. Some some people have. Um, the thing is, Gold Coast Lounge is an Afro noir film. I mean, a lot of times when we promote the film, we tell people, yes, it's that black and white film. Mm -hmm. So um, we've taken filmmaking down to its basic roots, and also we're taking Ghana to its basic roots. It is set in post-independent Ghana, yeah. um, and the, the film is a political metaphor. So we actually use a lounge, like a nightclub, to represent mm -hmm. Ghana okay. and all the characters that run that place represent different parts of Ghana society and different different Ghanaian uh, leaders from the past, etc. and everything. Wow. Yes. The, the movie industry in Ghana hasn't been that, you know, uh, we've been talking about it and uh, it looks like it had taken a, a, a slide yeah. down in the past couple of, uh, let's say, months or probably a year plus. Sure. Um, how has that affected you in any way? In a good way. With regards to production on uh, Gold Coast Lounge. In, in a very, very good way. It has affected me in a very, very positive way. Because when I, when I did music... Positive? Yes, absolutely. Oh, wow. Uh, when, 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 I did music, when I did music video, when I started music videos eight years ago, when I came to Ghana, um, um, I'm, I'm not saying the music industry wasn't the downside, but a new revolution was happening. Yeah. It was the Azonto period. Yeah. So I was very happy to be can part of... Can you do Azonto? Oh, yes, C a lot. I can. Oh, so you can do everything, C-Tech. I can do everything, C-Tech. Nice one. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> So I was glad to direct videos for like all the Azonto hits, yeah. not, not all of them, but you know, from Most of them, yeah. Vera, D Black, Skalu, you know what I'm saying? So, um, so I, I like to say that I helped, you know, that revolution with yeah. the music videos. So now, yeah. back then it was me, uh, Gio, AC Hene, and Big yeah. OJ were the four pillars of the music video industry. Mm -hmm. And now there's so many directors, the music industry is in a very, very, very good state. Yeah. You know, it's now the film industry, it needs a lot of, you know, it needs a revolution, but the good thing is, internationally, yeah. the movies that people know about Ghana are, are great ones. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, right now, Shirley's Potato Potatoes on Netflix, yeah, that's on good. Netflix, yeah. Burial of Kojo, yeah. Boom Keteke. Um, so when I go to Nigeria, these are the things that people talk about. It's like, mm -hmm. oh, Ghana, you guys are doing very, very well. Yeah. You know, so we premiered our film at the uh, African International Film Festival oh, interesting. in Nigeria. Yeah. And we won an award for a special jury mention award for feature film. So it went very, very well in Nigeria. And then wow. now, Ghana Movie Awards, 18 nominations. So wow, I think 18 yes. nominations. We'll be coming wow. to that, but I'm tempted to ask as well. So what, uh, you know, there's, there's, there's Kumawood, okay, and yeah. then there's uh, Gollywood. Well, well there's, I, I then there's, uh, there's <laughs> Akrawood. <laughs> if I can say that. Debatably. Now, it, it has, do, do you think there's a possibility, you know, uh, and people characterize uh, Kumawood with certain low production, uh, you yeah. know, do, do you think in any way that there's a possibility of a merger or a certain connection between the two? Let me tell I you see what, a disconnect. Let me tell you what is needed. What is needed is, um, the great thing about Kumawood is that yeah. they represent us. Yeah. You know, we all have an uncle like Lloyd. Yeah. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? We all have an uncle like Lil Wayne, etc. Yeah. So we have, um, it's, it's in tree, it represents us. Yeah. So what we did even with Go Coast Lounge, right? Mm -hmm. As, um, it's, we try, we try to produce it with a, the, the best um, standards as possible, yeah. right? And it's in local language. Mm -hmm. That's Ga, 70% Ga, and some yeah. tree, and yeah. Ewe, and then Pigeon, you understand? So Just to create that connection, I Exactly, I exactly. Yeah. So we should not be afraid to show our culture the way it is. Yeah. So what we're looking forward to eventually like have this, this premiere, uh, a premiere eventually in Kumasi, et cetera, mm -hmm. and everything. Because, and at the same time, still have it at international film festivals. Yeah. It's something that we're not ashamed to show everybody, yes. internationally and, and locally. I want to ask this question. I'm very sure it will probably excite you as well, MFR, um, that you feel, don't you see that there's uh, a lot of the Kumawood actors are hardly seen in the uh, I don't miss the Accra Wood movies. And is there a reason why and you, also you awards? Yes, and awards. Is, is there a reason why probably there's no because I would hardly see in a Shirley movie. I have never seen um, a Lil Wayne in a Shirley movie. I've never yeah. seen uh, you know the names are, are unending. So the thing is, it's not just about language. It's also about styles. You know, what I mean, the way the the Kumawood industry operates is not the same way that you know the Accra uh, film industry operates. I, isn't that the reason why there's the disconnect? Well, I mean, gradually you can bring a connection. Because, you know what I mean, at the same time, people like uh, Kofus Media, yes. a movie like Away Bus, I think they yes. got 16 nominations, whatever. Well, yeah. Lil Wayne is not in there, but... Um, Ejako is in there. Ejako is in there. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, he makes returns. I mean, so that's, so that's a film that has 16 nominations that got Ghana Movie Awards. So um, I, I think it's all about, one, having films yeah. that have a local language in there yeah. and the people that have a good command of it to um, connect with the audience are people like that from Kumawood. So yeah. do, do that, hire them, shoot it well, present it well, and boom. They'll, they'll what were some of your special unforgettable moments that you had in the production of Gold Coast Lounge? Well, the thing is, for me, what's special, apart from working with all the cast, this is the return of Raquel. Okay. Raquel, Raquel, Raquel the, the musician Raquel, Yes, right? Raquel, the oh, musician. You okay. know what I mean? She, uh, this is her return. Yeah. Um, and she, she's coming. I know it's the year of return. Year Everybody's of return. <laughs> yeah. Um, and she, she, um, she, she booked a flight, so she's arriving very soon to promote okay. the film. She's been nominated for Best Actress. Mm -hmm. And oh, wow. soon we have a song. Um, we, there are four songs that she recorded for the film. Wow. And so we have a song that, that we're going to release very, very, very soon and then uh, to help promote the film. My last question. Well, MFI, if you have any as well, how do you finance... Your projects? I, I um, cut my kidney and I sold it. I sold <laughs> my kidney. Ooh. Tell me you're kidding. No, 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 I am kidding. I, did not, I tell people that I sold my <laughs> kidney. He sold but the thing is, <laughs> here's the thing. Um, yeah. For the longest time in the industry, like people always found ways yeah. to just uh, finance themselves. Yeah. You know, I do extra business, and plus, I'm not broke. I mean, I've done music videos before, and all yeah. that stuff. So, you have, can I sure. So, um, but now, and uh, today, yes, yesterday was announced that the National Film Authority has mm -hmm. been established. Yes. Nanako Fado announced that. Mm -hmm. So finally, the film industry is about to have a structure. Yeah. So from there, I think things will just increase. Okay. Things will just like be a bit more systematic. Yeah. And then we have a very, very, very legitimate industry. Wow. That is my man, Pascal Aka, man. He, when he talk about film directing, you should watch some of the short films. Yeah, the short film that you produced. Okay. Um, um, just the, give me some titles. Oh, uh, that's Ghana Police, Banco Chronicles, her first time. It's yes. all on YouTube for free. It's all on YouTube. Go and check it out for yourself. I'm, I'm sure if you type in uh, Pascal Aka, it's AKA, you'll definitely see the videos that will pop up on there. I love them. Honestly, when I saw the shots that you had put in the short films, I said, wow, there's a new era of a <laughs> brand new way of making our movies in Ghana, and this man is championing that. Pascal, thank you so much for thank joining you so us. Much. I right. hope you play all of the awards. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Do you think I'll be a good actor? Give me a role to no, play. No, let, no, let me try no, something. No, Maybe. Uh, no, no, no. no. Yeah, say right. yes, absolutely. Yeah, yes. Jay Foley. What, what can I do in, what, what kind of personality will fit me in a, in a movie role? Jay, you could come in as a CEO of the next president of Ghana yes, or something uh, like that. Yes, I've been Fantastic. thinking about it, uh -huh. and I think the economy of this country uh -huh. can be taken to the next level. Yes, everything. Uh, and cut. And cut. There you go. I'm oh. in there. All right, let's get, my oh. <laughs> <laughs> let's get back to Miss Austin. She's going to jam us some more. You're watching Prime Morning right here on Joy Prime.